That's a hard one. I don't really know what the next five years will look like. Jenna Duggar might finally be turning on Jim Bob and Michelle from moving out of the big house to standing up to Jim Bob. She's been breaking all kinds of rules. But why now? What changed? And what does this mean for her future? Jim Bob and Michelle are known as one of the worst parenting duos in reality TV history. Michelle has infantilized Jenna her whole life, and Jim Bob has always tried to control her. But now it looks like Jenna is finally saying no more. For one, her living situation seems seems to have changed after all these years. Even though Jana is one of the oldest Duggar kids, up until very recently, she was still living with her parents. She's also one of the few adult kids who's not married, which is crazy considering she just turned 34. That's pretty much unheard of for a Duggar. I think we've all kind of assumed that she's just that much under Jim Bob's control, and for some reason, he doesn't want her to get married. So she's stuck at the house helping out with the household and and the younger kids. At least she was, because a while ago, news started spreading that she'd moved out of Jim Bob and Michelle's house. It looks like she now finally has her own place. It's supposedly a very small house on the Duggar property, so she didn't move too far, but it still seems like a good first step. Obviously, since she's still on Jim Bob's property, she's not completely free of him and his influence. But the fact that she moved out after all those years says a lot. I think she might finally be in a place where she wants a little more independence. She always claimed that she was happy living with her parents and siblings, so something must have changed. Maybe she's finally ready to start living her own life, which would make sense considering some of the other things she's done. In the spring of last year, she traveled to LA to visit Ginger and Jeremy. The US son obtained some photos from her trip, and the photos revealed something shocking. Jana was actually walking around the city in a tight sleeveless dress that ended just below her knees. For a regular person, that might not be a huge deal, but this is a Duggar we're talking about. Specifically, this is Jana. On that same outing, Ginger was wearing a sleeveless top and a pair of pink trousers. That's obviously a big deal for a Duggar kid as well, but at this point, Ginger doing that isn't that shocking. She's been way more open about not agreeing with all of Jim Bob's rules than Jana, and that's why it was so shocking to see Jana in that dress. What's also crazy is that about a month before that, Jana was actually seen wearing pants too. She appeared in Joy Anna's YouTube video, and you could see that she was wearing jeans. She was also seen wearing pants in one of Hannah's Instagram stories. Hannah is the wife of Jeremy, and she shared a video of the family having a Taco Tuesday on her social media. In the clip, you could see Jana wearing a green hoodie and a pair of black jeans. So it looks like she really is done with the Duggar dress code, but that's not the only way she's changed her style. Some people also believe that Jana has also gotten face fillers. Now, obviously, that would be pretty crazy for a Duggar to do, at least on on the surface, with all their modesty rules, you just wouldn't expect them to be okay with something like Botox. But many suspect that Jana has had that done, and so has Michelle. After Joy Anna shared a pregnancy update on her YouTube channel last year, many started speculating about Jana's face. Jana appeared in the video, and people pointed out that she looked kind of different. Many thought that it looked like she got Botox, and one person wrote, I wouldn't be shocked. I honestly think Michelle gets facial work done, so her daughters will probably do the same, at least with Botox. I mean, if this theory is true and Michelle does get Botox, then maybe it wouldn't be too shocking if Jana got it too. But it's still kind of crazy to think about someone from the Duggar family getting face fillers. It just seems a little hypocritical since they have all those other rules. Why is Botox okay of all things? It just doesn't make sense, but I guess that if Jana did get Botox because of Michelle, then this wasn't really her going against her parents. Still, her recent clothing style and the fact that she moved out of the big house speak volumes. Many people think that she might finally be fed up with her parents' rules, and this has seemingly been a long time coming. 
toward the end of Counting On, we've even got to see some of this new Janna. When the family were building gingerbread houses, she basically stood up to Jim Bob. Her house kept falling apart and she had no idea why. She probably had her own theories, but Jim Bob decided to step in and tell her what he thought was wrong. He said that she was using the wrong icing, but Jana didn't think that was a problem. And in the end, she was right because when she went to show her house to the camera, the whole thing just collapsed. She actually seemed kind of frustrated, but in the end, she just laughed it off. Since there was nothing she could do at that point, but it's interesting that she didn't just agree with what her dad told her. I really think that she's been kind of fed up with being told what to do for a while now, which does make sense because she clearly hasn't had it easy. Not too long ago, we found out what was actually happening behind the scenes when she was younger, and it's honestly horrifying. In September 2023, Jill released her book titled Counting the Cost. The memoir revealed a lot of interesting things, but what Jill wrote about Jana was just insane. She talked about the family's relationship with the Institute in Basic Life Principles, aka IBLP, and she said that Jana was basically used by Bill Gothard, the founder of the Institute. She wrote, we were new to the inner workings of IBLP, but we knew enough already to understand why it was only Jana who was invited. Jill said that she was the only Duggar girl who was blonde, and Bill Gothard really liked blonde women. Jill added, we joked about it calling Jana one of Gothard's girls. It didn't occur to me at all how strange, unsafe, and unwise it was. It's hard to know for sure what actually went down with all of that, but this story is really disturbing. I mean, what did Bill Gothard even want with Jana? He's currently 89 years old and she's 35, so they have a 55 year age gap. Whatever was going on with the whole Gothard girls thing probably wasn't very appropriate, especially since we all know that he eventually faced some serious essay allegations. I'm not saying that that's what happened to Jana. All I'm saying is that Bill Gothard does seem like a really shady person. So I really can't blame Jana for possibly being done with all this. I mean, sure, she still lives on Jim Brob's property, but maybe that's just temporary. I wouldn't be surprised if she actually moved to her own independent place sometime soon. I honestly hope she does that because she deserves to be free. Some of her siblings have already moved away from Jim Bob and the IBLP's teachings, so maybe Jana will be the next one to do that too. But what do you guys think? What's your opinion on Jana? Do you think it's time for her to move on and leave her parents' property? Do you think she'll actually do that? Let me know in the comments below.